Oh, took the wrong way there. Uh, we meant to go uh, to Laura. Sorry, Maria. She's making tea. Uh, I guess she's in the kitchen, though. Oh, no, she's here. Okay. All right. The red mug is yours. Mmm, it smells lovely. Oh, I met Zoe upstairs. She asked for a cup of tea as well. Yeah, I made it. I always make it. The yellow mug is Zoe's. Did you put plenty of milk in? Yes. Looks almost black to me. Ugh, I don't know. I don't drink tea. You know, we don't want to piss her off more, so... You go ahead. I'll get more milk from the kitchen and join you in a minute. Oh, you're a gem. Thanks! Wait, what about Nisha? Oh, Nisha drinks water. She's alright. Uh, okay. Alright, so you must be Al, the chef. Didn't even say hello, just passed through him. Warning, the cook is on fire. <laughs> That's a big fridge. Let's grab a laxative. What? Okay. Semi skimmed. Seems about right. Well, I don't think Zoe should be using the full fat one. <laughs> there we go. Uh, <laughs> okay. Wait a second. What's this? What, well, the laxative? That caught my eye as well. No, I couldn't. No. Nope. Could I? I'm not gonna do that. Nope. I'm gonna take it. Why not? Could be useful. <laughs> Maybe a congested uh, uh, elderly or something, but uh, I'm not gonna put laxative on her milk, that's for sure. I mean, I don't wanna get into more trouble. Alright, let's use milk on the yellow mug. Nice uh, little close-up of the mug. Ugh. Uh, what? Why did you say ugh? Milky tea. That's just disgusting. Oh, okay. Alright, let's grab mine. Not sure if I should grab if her. I spike it. No one will ever know. No, 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 don't. Don't fucking spike it. Milky tea. I'll just leave it here, I'm not sure. If I spike it. I'm not gonna fucking spike it. No one will ever know. Join Marie in the garden, stay in the station. Uh I'm not sure. Shall I just leave her tea there? Uh tough call. Alright, ju let's just join her in the garden. Praise the sun. What? It's from a... <laughs> oh, never mind. Dark Souls? Oh, she's smoking a spliff. Do you want one? Uh, what, fag or uh, what's that? Sure, why not? It makes my head spin. Is this your first one? Oh, I thought we'd... Yep. Oh, no. Then that's normal, mate. So, why do you want to work here, of all places? Money's good. Uh, because I love old people. No one else wanted me yet. Well, I couldn't afford to go to college. Um... Well, I couldn't afford to go to college. So, that kind of limits my choices. But I can't stay at home anymore, either. McDonald's the wasn't an I option. The out, the better. And for that, I need money. Oh, so you can, like, rent a place. Exactly. Oh, well, that's actually quite nice. One way ticket to New York? Like... I'm thinking more of a... One-way ticket to New York? What? I kind of hoped you'd stay. The thing is, 
I really want to get as far away from my stepdad as possible. He's just a big bag of shite. Has he... I'd never let him. God, I'd rather die. He is pretty disgusting, though. <sighs> but you know, it'll be okay. You'll stand on your own two feet and none of that will matter. And in the meantime, if you need a friend... I suppose you've got plenty of friends already. Well, uh, I've got too much shit at home to have friends. All my friends from school just moved on. Oh, there's well, Zach. There's Zach who lives next door. He's a geek, all right. But he's kind of cool. He waited for me this morning just to give me an umbrella. Zach? Is he American? Nah. He just likes to be called Zach for some reason. His uh, name's probably Zachary or something. Uh, you know, I'll go out with him if he asks, of course. The problem is I think he likes me more than I like him. But I have no time for romance, no, no. Yeah, I think he likes me more than I like him, honestly. The problem is... I think he likes me more than I like him. He'd almost asked me out today. But he chickened out at the last moment, I think. Sounds like a decent bloke. Give him a chance. Maybe I should. I don't know. Uh, why did he go back to this dialogue? I mean, okay, let's talk about friends from school, I guess. All my friends from school just moved on. Even my best mate, Carrie. She still texts me once a month, but she never comes over anymore. It's fine, though. She's got enough going on. You should try internet. It's what I do. I'm in this group, and we talk about kids, mostly. I can't go on the internet. My mum won't pay for the Wi-Fi. Wait. Did you say you got kids? Yeah, I got two boys. I was only 17 when I had Kieran. Wow. And Sam, only two years later. You married then? Oh, she was. No. Wasn't she? She said she had a hubby. <laughs> Me and you. Well, uh, guess we not. We should be friends. I agree. Unless... Unless you'd rather be friends with Zoe. I mean, I'd like to be friends with everyone, but uh, no way that's ever going to happen. Well, we have this special connection, you know. <laughs> yeah, maybe she's not all that bad, you know. Maybe she's not all bad. I don't know. I don't think we'll ever be friends. But I definitely don't want to be anyone's enemy. Exactly. Exactly. So don't worry. It's all good, mate. It's all good. You know, we can be cool. We should workers. probably get back now. It's time to see that new lady. Okay. I'll meet you outside her room. It's upstairs. What's her name? Oh, um, Retta, I think. Yeah, I remember someone's mentioned she was an artist. And she's got some creepy-ass paintings in her room. But she's new, so she hasn't got a name tag yet. Just look for the door with no name tag on it. I did uh, stumble upon that door earlier. Alright, cool. Let's get a move on. Back to work, I guess. Okay. Upstairs. Door with no name tag. How are we doing, ladies? All good? Enjoying the uh, sitting around. Don't even got a telly. Let me see if the cartoons are still uh, playing. Oh, it started again. Oh, there's more people here now. It's all old ladies. There's no, there's not a single man around here. Right, door with no name. Was it to? Uh, let me check. Is it? Yeah, it's this one. Uh, 
Oh, this is some creepy stuff. Uh, hello? Uh, what the fuck? Um, hello? Greta? Get it out! Oh, what? I must get it out! Lorelei? What the? What the? Fuck. I guess she's a performer as well. <laughs> Performing arts, that's her thing. Well, this is it. Rest in peace, my love. Oh, she did. Come on. Let's go, girls. Laura, you stay. Uh, I don't want to stay. Look, in a place like this, you see people die. Sometimes a year goes by and they're all fine. And then you suddenly get three dead in one week. You never really get used to it, but there's something you have to accept if you want to work here. And most of all, don't blame yourself. It was Greta's time to go. That's all it is. You uh, think you're going to be all right, mate? Uh, yeah. Uh, so you... Now you actually pretend that you care. I'm not gonna be rude. Yeah, thanks. Okay. Let's go then. There's still lots to do. I I have a feeling that Kretz is not actually dead. Not yet. You sure you'll be okay? Yeah. I'll be fine. Let's just keep busy. What's next to do? Oh, there's like a million things. But first... Do you play chess? Oh, is this another break? I know, we actually are interacting with the, the guests. <laughs> really show that lady who's boss. She's doing yoga again.
you see the lightning? It's gonna rain in a minute. Well, that's just bloody fantastic, isn't it? And another one. Oh, come on. My back is aching. I just want to go home now. Is there anything left to do? Nah. They're all in bed now. We'll just hang around the nurse's station trying to look busy and wait for the night staff. Let's go then. It's getting chilly out here. All right, it's time to go inside. Oh, not raining, it's just thundery. Bit weird. All right, everyone's off to bed. Uh, what was that? I have a feeling this uh, alarm panel is going to ring. Do you hear that? No. Exactly. Nice and quiet. At last. Oh, bloody hell. Why did I say that? Oh, what did they say? What is it? It's the bell alarm. Someone just pressed it by mistake. It happens. Can you check the panel for me? Yeah. Just give it a whack. It'll silence it. The sound it makes is really annoying. But I can't just give it a whack, can I? <laughs> give it a whack. But... Zoe will go mental if I break it. Just press it. Which room is it? It says 11. Room 11. What? Room 11? Oh, that's Greta's room, isn't it? Yeah, why? It's Greta. Whose room is it? Oh god, it is hers. It's hers. Are you sure it's 11? Oh god. Oh. Well, yes, absolutely. Come on. Who lives in that room? Greta. Oh, it's gave me Dead lady. Gave me the chills. Shit. There's maggots everywhere. These maggots. Ugh. Oh, I hate maggots. But we still need to get in there and switch the bell off. Where's Zoe? She's doing the meds now. And when Zoe's doing the meds, it's generally best not to talk to her. Why is Greta's body still there anyway? Exactly. Oh, they'll take it later tonight. Right. Then let's find a way to get rid of these things. Uh, I got water spray. And some chlorine tablets as well, I'm not sure. Yeah. I need to get rid of these maggots. Alright, how are we gonna get rid of these? Oh, they're all over the door handle. Alright, let me try to use the spray bottle here. The spray bottle is empty. Okay. Let me fill it with the... Uh... Okay, let's try and fill up the bottle first. Uh, hello? Game? That took longer than expected. Uh, let me see. Is there a sink? A sink I can use? Uh, there was a sink in one of the rooms, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, maybe we could just use that. Okay, let me go, uh... Let me go to one of the rooms, shall I? Maybe the kitchen. Maybe we can fill it in the kitchen. Let me see. No, we can't. Okay. Uh, let me just go into one of the rooms then. Uh, let me see. Uh, Marjorie. She's asleep let's just use this here there we go
All right. So let's mix the chlorine tablets with this spray bottle. The smell alone makes my eyes sting. This should get rid of the maggots. Hopefully. All right, I'm back, ladies, with the bug juice. Use the spray bottle on the door. Here we go. Worked like a charm. Oh, they didn't like that, did they? Horrible little buggers. Yeah. So, <laughs> we're going in? No, no, no. You know me. I get scared of my own shadow. Tisha? Maria. I don't want to do this on my own. There's no way I'm going in there. Sorry, Lorelei. Fine. I'll go and turn off the bell. But you owe me. It's only my... Only my first bloody day here. Tisha, do you want to... Input something here? No? Maybe just crack open the door and don't go in. Just peer through the door. Or peep. Now oh, whatever. Oh god. Okay. All right. It's just a body. No need to be scared. Hey! Oh, why did they close? Turn that buzzer off and we'll let you out. Are you kidding? Just lock me here with the dead body. Oh my god, she's gonna move. Where is the? Oh my god, she's gonna move. She's gonna move. She's gonna move. She's gonna move. Fuck it. Let's just. Do it quickly. That's just the light. But where's the bloody button that turns it off? What? What a storm after such a beautiful sunny day. Where's the goddamn button? It's proper raining now. Stop looking at the window. <sighs> Where is that bloody? Oh no. Oh, she has it. Oh, my God. Oh. Uh... How did she manage to grab this bell? All right, here we go. Get ready. the fuck did you just kissed us uh she just went for a kiss oh no <laughs> got you <laughs> what i got it all on my phone oh mate you should have seen your face what Yourself. <laughs> Didn't 
isn't she, Nisha? Oh my god. <laughs> this is so going on YouTube. <laughs> what? You filmed me? Oh, is this a prank? What? Was Greta in on it? Is she actually not dead? The fuck were the maggots then? You filmed me? <laughs> yeah, so? You can't do that. <laughs> Look, we always do that to new stuff. <laughs> it's funny. Get over it. This was a prank. <laughs> well, what do you think it was? Dead people don't ring their bells, do they? But we rang the bells, silly. Not Greta. <laughs> you really believed it was her, didn't you? <laughs> Precious. Uh. You knew about this too, Nisha? Yes, of course. Not you, Nisha. I ring the bell. <laughs> You're very scared. <laughs> Alright, you got me. Well done. I mean... Uh... Okay. You got me. Well done. <laughs> You're one of us now. Welcome to Pinecroft, Lorelei. Uh, great. Who actually... grabbed my arm then? Or what? And uh, what was that hallucination? I'm really glad you're alright, Mr. B. But you shouldn't have worried. Except for Greta, sadly, passing away. Well, everything's been hunky-dory. Oh, and that new girl, Laura. Or is it Lorelei? Yeah. She's done all right. Still a little rough around the edges. But I think we could make a good carer out of her. Oh, that's good. So... Cheers for the umbrella, Zach. And here I am now. Alright, cool. Where the hell are we then? A lonely seashore. Cool. Uh, we're gonna take a quick break here, guys, and uh, continue on on the next episodes. Uh, we need to explore this whole lands, fantasy land we're in, stuck right now. But we'll do that on the next one. Any hoots? Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye bye.